All right. Welcome back, everyone, to another chair yoga and mobility class. So see that you have your um, chair in a position where your feet can be resting down. If you're in a wheelchair, put on your wheelchair lock so that you're not going to be moving around anywhere. And then if it's possible, sit just a little bit away from the back of the chair and lengthen up towards the ceiling. Now, if that's not possible and you want to jet yourself all the way back up, feel free to do that as well. Good. All right. And then take a moment to relax your shoulders. Exhale completely. Let your eyes relax. Take a full breath in. And then let that breath out. Let yourself arrive on your chair, letting go of any of the outside activities of your day so far. Inhale. And exhale, let it go. Let your body weight start to just sink and relax into the seat. One more time like that, inhale. Very good. And then exhale fully. Let your shoulders relax. And keep your eyes relaxed for a moment. As we start to move through the practice and the flow, allow your breath to guide you. Doing your best to stay in your pain-free range of motion. And take breaks anytime you need it. On your next inhale, play with closing your hand into a, just a very gentle fist. And as you exhale, start to gently open up your palms. Very good. Keep your chin relaxed, shoulders relaxed. Inhale, close the fingers very gently and slow. And then as you exhale, open them up. Very good. Synchronize your movement and your breath. Two more. Inhale. Close your hands into a fist. Exhale. Open the palms up. Inhale. Close the hands. Exhale. Open your hands. Wonderful. And then allow your eyes to gently open up. Take one hand, we'll do one set at a time, bring it up towards, um, towards your eye level. We'll play around with moving our eyes now. Relax your shoulder, let your eyes fixate onto the finger. Very good. So if your right hand is up, I want you to block your left eyelid. So you're just looking at your right side. And if your left side, um, do that side. Otherwise, switch to your right. When you're ready to inhale, can you allow your finger to travel upwards? Keep your head neutral, but move your eye. Can you track your finger as it comes up? And then as you exhale, can you track your finger as it comes back down? Again, inhale, trace the finger up. Keep your head neutral, try not to let the head move around, and then exhale, trace the finger down. Good, one more like that. Inhale, trace your finger up. Exhale, trace your finger down. Good. Inhale the uh, finger back to eye level. Good. As you exhale, open it out to the side. Try to look to your finger as far as you can into your peripherals, and then inhale back to center. Good. Exhale, open. Try not to let your head move. Just move your eyeball. Inhale back to center. Good, again, exhale to the side. Inhale to center. Good, and then let that side relax. You can blink a few times, you can roll your shoulders out. That's it, just getting our vestibular and our eyes on board for our practice today. So go ahead and switch to your opposite side. So I'm gonna block my right side. If you did the other side, just switch it around. Finger comes up, shoulder relax, bend in the elbow. Good. Once you're fixated on your finger, as you inhale, lift it up. On the exhale, bring it down. 
That's it. And notice if your head is moving, try to keep your head static. So keep it still. Inhale up. Exhale down. Inhale up. Exhale down. Inhale towards center. Good, keep looking at your finger. Exhale over to the side, that's it. Can your eyes move? Can you trace your finger? Inhale, back to center. Exhale to the side, let your eye follow it. Inhale, back to center. And then exhale to the side. Inhale towards center. And then exhale, let it go. Good. Take a moment to blink a few times. Let that go. Great job. Good. Now take one of your arms, bring it out in front of you. Stretch as if you were going to push something away. So you want to elongate the elbow, spread across your fingertips as wide as it'll go. So again, now play with opening and closing the palm. Good. Take a breath in, squeeze the air, curl your fingers in tight like you were gripping something, aim your knuckles towards the ground, good. And then on the exhale, spread and open up. Again, inhale, spread your fingertips apart, squeeze them in, and then aim your knuckles forward, good. And then exhale, open up the palm. When the palm opens, try spreading across your fingers, aim your knuckles towards your face. Good, try again. Inhale, squeeze, 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 press downwards, good. And then exhale, open and spread, good. Then relax that elbow, make your hand into a gentle fist and circle out that wrist. Go in one direction a few times. And then switch your directions, let your breath be smooth and free. Paying attention to little sensations that you feel in your body as you move. Good, and then stretch that arm out in front of you. Open up your fingers. As you inhale, tap fingertips towards your shoulder. On the exhale, stretch it away. Inhale, tap. Exhale to reach. Very good. Inhale to tap. Exhale to reach. Now, if you're comfortable in that reach, spread across your fingers and press your palm forward. Inhale to tap, make a bend at the elbow joint and then exhale to reach and stretch it out. One more time. Inhale to tap, good. Now this time hold it there as you're tapping. As you exhale, sweep your elbow towards your heart, go up and draw a circle. Go in, go up and draw a circle. That's it. Towards, up and away. So now we're starting to move up into our shoulders, good. One more time in this direction. Good, and then reverse it. So take the elbow wide, up, and then forward and down. Good, out to the side, up, forward and down. If you have some restrictions, limitations, just work within that boundary so that you're not causing strain as you're moving the arm. Very good. Down, up, and forward. Last one. And then let that arm have a break, roll it off. Very good. Opposite side, we're gonna start with our wrist and finger motion. So now press the palm out in front of you. Very good. Spread across your fingers, aim your knuckles towards your face. So you're really feeling a lot of activity in the front of your forearm. Then start to grip the air. Can you curl your fingers in and then aim your knuckles towards the ground. Stretch the top wrist and then open up as you exhale. That's it. Pull back. Knuckles towards face as you inhale, curl, 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 squeeze, aim, knuckles down. Feel the stretch in the top of your forearm. That's it. And then open back up. That's it. You got this. Couple more. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze as you breathe in. Aim your knuckles down. Allow it to stretch. And then exhale, open it up. Very good. One more time. Inhale, squeeze the air. Pull, pull, pull. Aim the knuckles down. Good. And then exhale, open it up. Drag your elbow back and start to circle out that wrist. Let your breath be free as you're circling. Smooth and deep, go in one direction. And then reverse, go to the opposite side. That's it. Move through your pain-free range. Let that joint warm up too. 
and one, and then stretch your arm out, open up your palm like you're holding up a tray. Relax your shoulder, doesn't need to be very high. Lower it if you need to. Inhale, bend. Tap on the exhale, extend the arm out. Good. Inhale, bend. And tap on the exhale, extend your arm out. Very good. Inhale, bend and tap the shoulder if you can. On the exhale, extend your arm out, aim your palm out. Fingertips are now pressing towards your body. Inhale, bend. Exhale, extend. Good. Inhale, bend. Exhale, extend. Good. Inhale, bring a bend. Tap your fingertips to your shoulder. On the exhale, swing in, up, and then relax it around. Now let your breath be free and start to move around your shoulder. Fingers are lightly tapping. Elbow is making the circle. So we're moving around, guided by the elbow. One more in this direction. And then reverse it. So we sweep back, we sweep up, and then we come down in front. Sweep back, up and down in front. Good. Out to the side, up and down. Out to the side, up and down. One more time. Very nice. And then lift that arm a little break. Roll it off a little bit. All right. So we made our way up towards our shoulders. If it's in your range of motion on the inhale, lift both shoulders up to your ears. Good. And then on your exhale, pull them back and then slide them down. Again, inhale up. Go back, exhale them down. Very nice. Inhale up, back, exhale them down. Inhale, lift, back, exhale down. Now reverse that. Can you squeeze them together? Inhale, squeeze and try to hide your elbows back. Lift up and then drop them down in front. Good. Inhale, back, up, exhale down in front. Very nice. Inhale, back. Up, exhale, down in front. One more time. And then relax it, roll it out a little bit. Let your body roll and sway. Can you roll one side, let your spine move? Can you roll to the other side, let your spine move? That's it, just let it be free. Let yourself wiggle in your seat. Good. And then rest your hands on top of your knees. And now, if you haven't already separated your back, give yourself that moment to get a little gap between you and the chair. Rest your hands towards your kneecaps on your inhale. Bring your heart forward. Roll your shoulders back. Drive the heart to the front of the room. Good. As you're exhaling now, curl the spine towards the seat, caving out your body and relax your neck and your head. Inhale, move forward. Good, and then exhale, press it back. Good, inhale, move forward. Good, and then on the exhale, round it back. Wonderful. If that's comfortable, start dragging your arms. Inhale, pull the arms back, let them drag along your lap and try to hide your elbows back behind you. As you exhale, reach for your kneecaps, round and curl your spine, chin drops to your chest. Very good. Inhale, come forward. Option to drag the arms back if that serves you. Keep your shoulders off your ears. And then exhale, round and relax your back. Good. One more time like that. Inhale, pull back. Allow for max extension of your spine today. And then as you exhale, reach and round it out. Very good. On the inhale, now circle your arms up. Instead of reaching them up and over your head. Even if they're not symmetrical, one might go more than the other. Just find that range up top. And then exhale, float your arms back down. Good. Try out in front. Inhale, arms in front, reach up. And then exhale, float your arms down. And then if you can, turn your thumbs in, stretch them back. Good. Inhale, out to the sides and reach. Good. Exhale, float them down. 
Inhale forward, reach up. Exhale, start to come down, turn your thumbs inwards and reach your arms back. Keep your spine tall, just try to reach out behind you. Inhale again, out to the sides and up. That's it, relax your face, relax your head. Exhale, float it down. Inhale up in front of you, reach. That's it, nice big breath in. Exhale, throw your thumbs forward, stretch back and reach back, relax the neck and your head down. That's it. Inhale, back towards center, reach your arms. Very good. And then exhale, lower one arm down. So I'm gonna take one arm, lower it down, either to your lap on the same side, to the opposite hip, or grip your armrest if you have one there. Inhale, climb up to the ceiling. On the exhale, can your body bend and reach to the side? Good. Inhale to rise up. And then exhale, let your body bend and reach towards the side. Good. Inhale up. Very good. Exhale, reach and stretch over to the side wall. As you inhale, rise up. On the exhale, let that arm go and roll it out. Take any stress or strain out of the body as we move through our practice. Great job. Switch sides, inhale both arms, reach and stretch. If you're more comfortable, push your feet down. See if you can allow a little bit more extension through your body. Nice, exhale, opposite arm comes down. It can stay on the same leg, it can go to the opposite leg, or you can hold the armrest as a little bit of an anchor for yourself. Inhale again, find length through your body, reach and stretch. On the exhale, let your body bend to the side. Very good, inhale to rise up. And then exhale, let your body bend and stretch over to the side. Good. Inhale upwards. Good. And then exhale, big reach and stretch over. Inhale to rise. And then exhale to let that arm go now and roll that off a little bit. Wonderful. Good. And then rest the palms towards your lap as you inhale, circle your arms up again, big reach. This time, bring your hands through the heart as you exhale, land them to your legs, and now shift forward at your hips. Can you move at your hip joint and allow your back muscles to lengthen down, whatever degree that is for you. On your inhale, can you lift back up? And then on the exhale, hang on to the legs and round again back into this cat pose. We're curling up our back muscles. On the inhale, move your heart forward. This time, if it's available, stretch your arms back. Use them to extend your body. Good, and then on the exhale, take your palms, land them together. Good, rest them over to one side leg. As you inhale, give a leg a kick. On the exhale, bring it back. Switch your sides, inhale, kick. Exhale, bring it back. Very good, inhale, kick. Start to practice bending and straightening out the leg. Good. Again, inhale, kick. Exhale, return. Very nice. Inhale, kick. Exhale, return. Switch your sides. Inhale, kick. Exhale, return. Perfect. On your next inhale, stretch your arms up, reach up. Very good. Hold. And then exhale, take your palms down, gently lean forward into it, rest the hands and allow your spine to travel forward. That's it, work out the little kinks in the back, start to notice what you're feeling. On your next inhale, lift yourself back up. On the exhale, grip for your knees and feel your back round and slouch, be easy with your body. Good, on your inhale, open up wide, stretch your arms back, lead with your heart. Keep your shoulders off your ears. Try to squeeze them back behind you. And then exhale, take your palms together, land them together. Very good. Go ahead and rest the hands either above one leg or scoop up underneath it if that's in your range. When you're ready to inhale, kick your leg out in front. On the exhale, drag it back. Now A, you can rest the foot. B, you can lift the foot. Okay, either one works fine what's in your range of motion today. Inhale to extend. Good. A to rest. B to lift. Good. Inhale to extend. Start to get a little bit more movement through the leg. 
exhale to tap or to lift if you're lifting. Keep the back upright. One more time, inhale, big stretch. Exhale, lift, that's it, good. Let that leg relax, inhale your arms up, give yourself a big reach overhead. Exhale, come down, hands either A, rest on top, or B, you can scoop below. On your inhale, kick your leg out, good, pull back on your foot. On the exhale, either A, take rest, or B, lift the knee. Very good, inhale, kick out, find what works for you. Exhale, draw back, either resting or lifting. Good job, inhale, two more, you can do this. Kick, exhale, and lift. Inhale, and exhale, and lift. Very good, let that foot have a little break. As you inhale, swing your arms up, big reach, stretch up. Very nice, reach up through your fingers, exhale the hands down, rest them to your legs, allow your body to move forward in space. Very good. On your next inhale, rise up. On the exhale, hang on to the legs, curl and round your spine back. See if you can feel your shoulders getting pulled apart here. Good. And then inhale, open up your chest. Now the shoulder blades are coming towards one another. Reach back, stretch back. Very good. And then as you exhale, land your palms again back to your center. Very good. Now on your next inhale, play with lifting up your heels and then exhale, lowering your heels. Inhale, lift, press into palms. Exhale, lower. Good, again, inhale, lift. Exhale, lower. Okay, now inhale, lift and hold. Rest your hands on the exhale, allow your knee to move in from side to side. Now, if you're more comfortable, you can scoot your hands just behind the armrest here or inside the armrest, widen your feet and allow your knees to dip forward. So we're playing now a little bit more with your hip rotation. Inside, inside, that's it. Inside, inside, good. Let it loosen up, three, two, one, good. If you're comfortable, you can keep your hands behind you here. If you have your armrests, you can support them. Try exhaling, lifting a knee, go up, go out to the side, tap it down. Opposite side, flex, lift, and tap down. That's it, go up, squeeze, open, and land. Go up, squeeze, open, and land. Two more on this side. That's it, with your breathing, be gentle with your body. Just get the motion in the hip, again. Good, land back and center very good switch your sides keep the body upright on your next exhale lift good inhale exhale we land good inhale to lift it and land very good just feel it up you might have more challenge on one side this is my more challenging hip so feels like i'm doing a lot more work than i'm doing on this side so just honor where you are. It doesn't have to be the biggest motion. Just feel the leg coming in, the leg moving out. Good, leg comes in and leg moves out. Last one, inhale. Exhale, land, awesome. Whew. And then let that relax, good. You can allow your legs to sit a little bit wider again. Lift up through your heels. And then again, play with the knees going in and out. Inside, outside, inside, outside. If you're more comfortable, hold the armrest, dip the knee forward. Good, whatever level you're at, just get this movement inside and outside. One more, in and out. Very good. Perfect, and then stretch the legs out. Support yourself on the armrests or sneak them inside the armrests onto the seat. As you inhale, turn your feet out. On the exhale, turn your toes in. Inhale, turn the feet out. Exhale, turn them inwards. Good, again, inhale. 
Exhale. Inhale. And exhale. In. And out. Good. Inhale. Turn them out. Good. Now drag them back to the floor in a wide position and then sit your body back so that you feel more upright. So now we have the legs in a wide position. Very good. When you're ready to inhale, sweep one arm up. On the exhale, let your forearm tap the knee and stretch the arm overhead. Very good. Inhale to come back up and relax here as you exhale. Switch the arm, inhale to rise, exhale to reach, drop your arm down, big reach in your stretch. Inhale up, exhale down. Okay, now let's repeat that, about three more on each side. Take your time, move at your own pace. If it's slightly slower or faster than me, don't worry about it. Go up on an inhale, exhale, stretch. Good, go up on an inhale, Exhale, stretch. That's it. Plant your feet down, roll into your side body. In and then out. In and out. Very good. One more on each. In and out. Good. In. Arm goes up. Exhale. Reach and stretch it out. Now inhale back to your center. Exhale, drop one arm down to your leg. And I want you to bring your elbow just slightly in front of that thigh and stretch your arm in front. So we're using that bottom arm to press the knee open a little bit. Press down through your heel. Good. Top arm, I want you to draw a line. So draw a line from your hand up to the ceiling as you exhale, look up. Inhale, look down. Exhale, pull. And try to unwind. So keep trying to turn your body upwards. Inhale, and then exhale. Pull on the elbow, stretch and reach. If you're comfortable, look up. Two more. Inhale, exhale. Press the knee back, rotate, stretch. One more time, you got this, breathe in. Get ready for the hold. On the exhale, open up your arms, breathe and hold. Spread your arms in opposite directions. Allow your chest to turn upwards. If your neck is sore, relax it. If you're comfortable, try turning the head and looking up. Hold for five, keep breathing. Four, that's it, full smooth breath. Three, two, keep reaching the top fingers. And then one, climb up, that's it. And then give a little wiggle, give a little rotation. Yeah, let that out, let it go. Very nice. Same thing to the other side. So now opposite arm, we float them out to the side. Bend at your elbow, crank it in front of the knee, and then stretch it out. So it's staying like a lamp post. This top arm, try finding that length through it. Good. As you inhale, tap down to the bottom arm. On the exhale, pull elbow in line with shoulder or approximately there, stretch and reach up. Inhale to move downwards. And then exhale to pull back, rotate and turn. Very good. Inhale to come down. Exhale to rotate and spin. Inhale to come down. Exhale to rotate and spin. Very good. Inhale to go down. Now this time we hold it. Exhale, rotate, spin if you can. Hold, if you need to lower the arm, feel free to. Press against the bottom arm, reach up to your fingers. Try turning the body. Head can stay relaxed or we can look up to the thumb if we feel good today. Hold for five, keep full smooth breath. Four, reach up through your fingers. Try to turn the trunk. Three, good, two, and then one. Slowly come up, that's it. Feel that side of your body, make some wiggles, make some rolls. Very nice, that's really good work. And then gently heel toe the legs a little bit inward, so knees in, knees out, knees in, knees out, in and out, three, two, and then one, good. Land the legs in a neutral position, very nice. As you inhale, stretch your arms up, reach them up, 
On the exhale, take your palms down through the heart. Lean or turn towards, I'll mirror your motion. Turn towards your left leg. Take your right hand over the left knee. Sweep your left hand either to the armrest, so it's holding, or to the seat. So now we're rotating. So I have a little gap in my legs. I'm going to close this gap if it's available. Inhale, lift the trunk of the body. And on the exhale, try rotating over to the side. Good. Inhale back to center. And then exhale, rotate to the side. Try turning your body. Inhale to center. And then exhale, find that rotation. Find the twist in your body. One more time and then rotate. Very good. As you inhale, come back. Stretch and reach your arms up. Find length in your body. Now we'll switch sides. So opposite arm on the exhale. Take left arm to the outer edge of the right knee. Right arm is holding the armrest with the shoulder relaxed or sneaking it in towards the back or the side of the seat. As you inhale, squeeze the inner legs. Lift the trunk of your body. On the exhale, turn your body over to one side. Good. Inhale to center. Exhale to rotate. Inhale to center. Exhale to rotate. Inhale to center. And exhale to rotate. Inhale towards center. Create a slight gap in your feet. Reach up, stretch up. Now exhale, bring your palms down, shift forward at your waist, and slowly start to drag your arms down. You could stay halfway here with your elbows sort of resting on the legs. You can lean in if that's available to you and let your neck and head relax. Either way, find this forward motion. If you're up here, you're nice and tall, keep relaxing your head. If you're down here, same thing. Can you breathe into the back of your body? And can you allow yourself to fold as you exhale? Taking a full breath in. And slow and steady breath out. That's it. Let your neck relax. Let your head relax. Inhale. And exhale. One more time. In. and out. Very good. And then inhale, lift up to your chest. Put your palms up onto your knees. On the exhale, press yourselves up towards your nice and tall seat. Go slow in case you feel dizziness. If your blood pressure is a bit low, take your time adjusting or readjusting back to center. Inhale, hang on to the legs. Bring your heart forward. Just a gentle rock. Lift the chest. And then exhale, round and relax. Good. Inhale forward. Exhale, round and relax. Inhale forward. And then exhale, gentle, round and relax. Very good. And then start to sit yourselves back into your seat in a way you feel nice and comfortable at the back. Extend the legs forward for a moment. Play with pointing the toes and flexing. Pointing and flexing. Good. Point them, flex them, and then start to make a circle pattern. That's it. Either direction, just circle it around, then reverse it. Good. Three, two, one. Good. Tap out the legs and then line them up so you feel more comfortable. So to get me comfortable, I shifted all the way up to the back of the chair. You might want to lean with a little bit with your pelvis forward as we move into some relaxation. Take your time, find what works best for you, and then settle your arms. They might want to sit on the armrest today with the hands on the lap, or you might fold the hands together on the lap or just keep them on the armrest. So we're adapting the body so that we can relax here for just a few minutes. So if you have to make any wiggles or adjustments, Make them now, then allow your eyes to close. Very good. And start by exhaling all the air you can out of your body. 
As you inhale, breathe in through your nose and start to feel around your ankles and your feet. And then as you exhale, can you relax your ankles and your feet? Then inhale into the ankles, into your feet. Relax your eyes, relax your face. As you exhale, relax your ankles, relax your feet. Inhale into your knees. Feel the space around your knee joints. And as you exhale, give that space permission to relax. Very good. Inhale into your kneecaps, feel them. Good, and then as you exhale, give permission for your knees and your legs to relax. Into your hips, take a breath in. And then as you exhale, relax your hips. Relax the lower legs. Inhale. And then exhale fully. Feel the weight of the legs, the weight of your hips, everything dropping into the ground. Then move into your shoulders. Inhale. Feel the space around your shoulders. As you exhale, let them drop, let them release. Again, inhale into your shoulders. And then exhale, let your upper arms and your lower arms start to settle. Inhale into your elbows, into your wrists. And as you exhale, soften around that space, around your wrists, around the elbows. Then breathe in. And then exhale, let it go. Let your palms relax, let your arms relax. And then inhale right into the top of your head. And as you exhale, allow everything to relax, your arms, your legs, your neck, and your head. Letting your whole body start to sink and start to melt into the chair. And soften the space around your eyes and around your jaw. And just for a few moments here, allow yourself to breathe and rest. Coming back to your breath anytime the mind wanders. Very good. And then slowly start to inhale and wiggle your fingers, wiggle your toes. Good. Draw your palms together into the center of your chest and just start to rub the hands a little bit. Build some heat within your palms. 
and then cover over your eyes. Take a little bit of a break from the light that's inside the room. And then open up your eyes inside your palms and gently let your hands float back into the center of your chest. Inhale here. And as you exhale, bow to your own effort. Thank yourselves for showing up today. Thank you so much for joining me. And have a lovely rest of your day. Namaste, everyone. <laughs>